Hi, my Aries baby, my pet milks. What it do, what it do, what it do. It's your favorite. The one and only extra love coming through to see what's popping with you. What up, my Aries? Top of the day. What up, though? Yes, what up, my badass B? I see you've been making a lot of appearances lately, haven't you, my pet milks? For shizzle. Because, you know, I always bless the cars in between family members. And right off the gate, the first deck, we, you know, we got like two new decks out here. We're trying and off rip. You know, you made an appearance, my baby. The Emperor. So succulent. Look how beautiful you are. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I see your body has healed now, right, my baby? Definitely have healed your body. A key phrase for you until we chop it up would be moving. A lot of our family members are physically moving. Moving in the spiritual realm. Moving on emotionally for things that pain them. Moving on mentally for things in the past that they cannot change. Movement is prevalent, right? So, off rip, these are the messages. This is what you was told to do. Move away from anything that does not make you happy. Anything that does not make your heart skip a beat, you know what I'm saying? Any being or thing that is not devoted and true to you, chuck the deuces, boo, you know what I'm saying? Anytime you see someone moving backwards, bringing up the past, yada, 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 you know to flat out ignore them, right? I see that you've been um, told to move on, do something else, and use this opportunity to grow, right? Because while you are doing that, things are falling together. See, for a minute, some, some would have tried to have things fall apart, but now things are really falling together. Because I see my emperors, you know what I'm saying? That... You was promised a Ten of Cups. This has um, been prevalent. Ten of Cups is a lot of our family members that have North Node and Aquarius, South Node and Leo, or at the very least have um, North Node and Leo and South Node and Aquarius. That's like harnessing like heavy energy. But you got the Ten of Cups, my baby, right? Definitely got that. Everything that you wanted, everything you desire, fulfillment in all the ways, is, you see it. You definitely are happy at home, children, family life, beautiful home. Making it pop. You're the wizard, my baby. <laughs> For sure. Beautiful yard, kids playing, frolicking. And I see you love your family with all your heart. Right, my baby? Definitely love your family with all of your heart. And you're very, very happy when they're around. Yes, you are. And I see the shepherd is here for you too, right? That crystals energy, the crystals Consciousness, Jesus Christ, the blood of the Lamb. The Lamb is here, my baby. <laughs> That's what I call my shepherd card. Jesus Christ, my baby. You see, you have some mighty en enemies that you were unaware of. That's the only reason they were mighty. Right? Not so much since you've been paying attention to them. Right? Um, and it was definitely like you uh, went up against the mountain. But guess what? Again, 
like I like I think it was Aquarius. You got divine feminine for sure, for sure, stepping out to the forefront. See, divine feminine and divine masculine for sure always comes up into all of our family's readings, from the Aries all the way down to the Capricorn. Especially divine feminine. Mama is here for everybody. But on certain instances, when people just be playing out or whatever, they, they come in full effect. So again, I must stress, does it look like divine feminine is playing? <laughs> Not to me. But see, the divine feminine is coming to you because, of course, you're a badass being. Title card, you know what I'm saying? Very peaceful and serene. Definitely harnessing this dragon energy. They are there for you. Your family is here, my baby. Definitely. So let's let's see what's going on. All right, my baby. Woo 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 woo. See, you're the son, a child of the divine, right, my baby? You definitely have merged your upper and lower nature. Yeah, and you definitely had to make some sacrifices. You definitely have given up a lot. A lot of things have been taken from you, my baby. Real spill, right? Let's see, you got to swore the truth, my baby. Shekinah, divine wisdom through here, my baby. Yes, that throat chakra working too. Yes, blue rays all day, my baby. See, you found your voice, huh? And you, like I said, you're moving on from motherfuckers that try to have you like this. Try to have you all up in your mind with the deception and envy. Try to have you feeling like you're going crazy. You're not tripping. They are. They're try, trying to have you fall. Ooh, sacral chakra. Ooh, crown chakra. This is like, wow. <laughs> Mm -mm -mm. Using your creativity to find your voice again. It helps you tap into the divine. Look at that. Dig you. All these energies you're harnessing. Funny how, how it ends up. 2, 5 equals 7. You got your voice because using and wielding your creativity, harnessing that energy quite well. Definitely tapping into the divine. This is beautiful, my baby. What more can I say? Right? Because that's the message I got for you. This video is going to trigger a lot of people. But you know, we always come with the truth. We keep it funky about not only ourselves, who, whomever. You know what I'm saying? That's with that fuck shit. They can get it quick, you know what I'm saying? That's how the divine is operating right now. Right? But she's... <laughs> right, my baby? I see, because you've been seeing orbs and lights and, and, and um, swatches of colors. A lot of our family members have gotten their docetic um, body. Their senses has been um, leveled up, shall we say, right? So, a lot of our family have been witnessing, like, God-like power and visions and knowledge and wisdom. Um, um, nif, um, nif, sense, visions. I see a lot of our family see on a microscopic level. You know about teeny and tiny and we, don't we? We, we, right? Um, I see a lot of our family have astral travels. Definitely astral travels. You know you're definitely protected and connected. For sure. I see you got your bootstraps on. It's a lot of ancestral crosses out here. A lot of aunts and uncles. That's prevalent, you know, today. We're going to say uncles, 
and aunts. <laughs> That's what aunts and uncles are going to be known on this channel. You know what I'm saying? Ox. Right? Them ox. Right? And those uncles. <laughs> We're going to put it like that, right? You see a lot when you be meditating. I see you can read minds too, huh? Didn't know you had that ability. I see you an adept at meditating. An adept. <laughs> yes. That's why you pulling two, five, and seven energies. Yes. And you see the unnatural besides other things. You see the illusions, don't you, my baby? You adept at that. Cutting through the bullshit. And you see when it pay off, when you mess with people, and you see when it don't. I see that you also have a stalker driving past your home. Right, my baby? Someone that you were intimate um, with, I, I hear that you were legendary. <laughs> That's the word I heard, legendary. Right, my baby? <laughs> Someone is singing. Singing. Thinking, I'm going to say it's all good. Right, my baby? Yes. Definitely operating out of your higher nature. So you definitely is a genius. Definitely bright. Bright as a light. You know, of course. You know what I'm saying? Badass being. You were smart enough to use your creativity for the good of all. And that's what strengthened your connection. <laughs> right, that throat and that crown chakra is on point, my baby. I see you wielding that ace of sword real, real swell, right, my baby? <laughs> I see you're someone that uh, people are confident in, they can trust you, you know what I'm saying? Word is bond and word is your honor. Definitely a moon child, you know what I'm saying? I see you're monogamous, you know, I'm feeling like nun and priest-like energy. Definitely priests and priestesses out here. You know what I'm saying? I see you keep it cute. You know what I'm saying? Very um, hygienic. We're going to put it like that, right? I see you have a bounce when you step, a spring in your step. You like luxury. You like to bathe in luxuriant waters. Definitely a roughy toughy. You have endured a lot. Like I said, you have definitely sacrificed a lot. Ever since you were young. Rainbows are going to be prevalent. <laughs> Rainbows are prevalent for you, my baby. I see you've been content, you know what I'm saying, definitely getting back into your routine. A lot of our family members are working out their arms, you know what I'm saying, very brave, you know, love to eat fruits and vegetables, love the rainbow, don't you, my baby, you definitely love the rainbows. <laughs> you're the lucky charm, I keep telling you, and at some point you're going to believe me, you love these rainbows. Look at the Irish, right, my baby? <laughs> right. I see you pleasant. You sing a lot. Definitely hit them high notes, can't you, my baby? Definitely. You're the truth. Yes. Divine feminine is out here, my baby. So then, you know, I was about to chill. I ain't gonna even lie. My pet milk. So I was about to chill, relax, you know, take me a little sip before I step in your energy, right? But then I just kept hearing bastard, you know what I'm saying? Bastard, bastard. Like somebody was calling you that. 
And I see that someone has been calling you that for a long time. So this is where the triggers come in. Because it was revealed to me as it was revealed to you. And this is the truth. And this is the truth coming from someone's mother. Someone's mother is telling them the truth about their father. Right? Because I got to be thinking... And it got to be looking like someone's father is jealous of their relationship. Somebody's father is jealous of their child's light and the love that they have for the divine feminine. And that's the truth. Right under the same card. You know, it's, it's almost as if the child reminds the father of how they was when they were young, right? But see, they they did theirs the wrong way. They chased after their spiritual. I mean, they chased after material things instead of chasing after their soul, right? Picking up the pieces pieces and the fragments of them, right? They were worldly, whereas this child. Definitely a divine. Divine feminine. Divine, like I said, divine feminine most of the time plays the background. Really don't come out too much unless it's something crucial. This is a message to someone that was trapped all in their head. They couldn't understand why a parent would sacrifice their peace and happiness. Because this child realized that their greatest enemy was their own parent. That was the mountain that they were going around. Right, my baby? <laughs> this parent tried to have their child trapped up in their mind. Trapped up in their mind. Because they wouldn't save them. This parent almost feels like the child doesn't love them. But this parent have dropped so many burdens on this child, you know, just to make the child's heart black. You know what I'm saying? To try to break this child's spirit. Real spill. That's what the cars look like right now. Well, we about to get into it, my baby. But it's definitely a father that has put a hex on their child's fun. Spoke ill over their life and their accomplishments strictly because they're jealous. But see, now, my baby, you know you're going to have to walk away. You're going to have to walk away. From this burden, ten of swords. This is is burdening. It's putting a burden on your home life. This hex. Well, not really, because you're protected by the divine. But this was the plan. To have the child all fucked up in their feelings, feeling low and and, and just like a nobody, just like them. But see, this child had love for their parent, and it was blinding them. They didn't. They couldn't peep the play at first. They went down through there a couple of times. <laughs> a whole lot of times, really. It's crazy. But see, this child is learning who to mess with and who not to. And they definitely feel cheated, like somebody ran off with their energy. That's why the shepherd is out here. You know, the lamb tended to the flock. It's definitely still an energy. This child's energy. You know, under the guise they needed help. Mm -mm -mm. Because they know that the child will always 
come to their rescue. Those days are over. Yes, just definitely a spell. Definitely be like magic. Cards don't lie, people do. The parent sent ten darts. Curse this their child's relationship ten times. Then you got the ten of wands. Try to have them messed up mentally. Spiritually Sending torment demons to their child. Because we're going to keep it real. You know what I'm saying? About everything and every being. This is a wicked person. A wicked person. But I'm going to tell you something. No child deserves to be treated like this. What same person would treat a child like this? Have them, to have them debilitated and fucked up. Spiritually, a karmic ass parent, right? And then knowing that this would mess them up mentally. But did they stop? Nope. That was the mountain, the hurdle that this child had to deal with, right, my baby? Let's break it down some more. Strictly because the, the, the dad was a hater of this child. Because they had sucky, fucked up ass relationships. They had a broken heart. They was passing and spewing that vile and venom toward their own child. Really children. I see two children. Because they was a hater. They were a hater, my baby. They tried to make this child a karmic. Tried to make this child a karmic, my baby. Strictly because their heart was messed up. Got a lot of spiritual deaths to play. But I see... You're with another badass being. Right, my baby? <laughs> Emperor and the High Priestess, Granddaddy and Granddaughter, the Beloved, right? Anna. It's, it's, it's family members named Maya. Family members named Anna. That's prevalent. But you saw that someone was playing with your emotions. You saw that somebody was playing with this love. Prevalent theme, right? You saw somebody was playing. Someone saw that in this union, the high, whoever harnessing the high priestess energy, we're just going to say a female, a divine, saw that someone's father was jealous of their life, jealous of their currency, their life force, their chi, their prana, jealous of the loving relationships, jealous of the loving home life that they had, that they actually worked hard for, and jealous of their child's place in the world, real spell. King of Pentacles, we already noticed the hubby energy. High Priestess must be the wife, and they're out here in the world. And this king of wands, this karmic ass parent, is sitting here watching this union. But guess what? The high priestess's dad is out here. <laughs> I don't think this person wants no smoke. Yes, watching your coin. They're watching the money. That's what's making them upset. Nine of Pentacles. The lovers. That's just it, bottom line. The, 
the father is jealous that the child looks like the son has somebody that truly loves him, truly is invested emotionally in him, truly is a divine counterpart. This is the lover's card with the divine over it, protecting and connecting it. This is how your partner holds you, my Aries. And divine hold both of y'all. And the divine feminine is very healing. And the dad secretly desires, secretly desires euphoria. Or that the love that the child is getting. Complete success. The parent never had it. The dad never had it. And that's the ace of swords. The truth again. Couldn't make this shit up, man. The empress is out here. Divine union. The dad is watching the son heal. Learning that the son is a badass be being. Truly, truly, truly a badass being. Happy and content up here with the empress. This is a divine union. The dad comes around to see if the spell is working. To see if the child is fucked up. Or if the child... Man, I couldn't make this up. I'm about to show you. <laughs> Look at this divine union. Royals. You know what I'm saying? Definitely. Like I said. Swan knights and swan princesses out here. The father, which is this karmic king of ass wands. You know what I'm saying? Weakest partner always loses. Right, is watching this love between the emperor and the empress and the sending black magic their way. Remember, I told you, ten of swords, ten of uh, wands is black magic, right? And that's the truth. This is the portal to the truth. Two ace of swords, right, my baby. So this motherfucker trying to see. I'm about to show you, man. This shit is crazy. Okay, first. <laughs> this karmic king of wands, the hating ass dad, is sitting here looking to see. Let me bring it up. Is sitting here looking to see if the spell works. Every three days, they come back to see if the relationship is fucked up, right? Seeing what havoc they have caused in this union, right? Seeing if the son has broken up and left his love. Seeing if they still work. Ten of swords. Ten of wands, right? <laughs> Because they got a black heart. So we're going to continue to pull. I just wanted to show you, my baby. This shit is real. People is grimy, no matter who they is. Grimy. But I see you learning the truth. They were sitting there and seeing if they spell works. Don't let this demon back in your heart, house. Use black salt at your doors and your windows to alleviate this. That's a freebie for me. Extra love. This is a black hearted person. And that's the truth. That's the truth, my baby. Black hearted being and thing. Woo 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 woo. Justice is out here though. <laughs> Justice is out here. On this father. And I see you were told to abandon this situation, abandon this shit, definitely abandon. Mm -mm -mm. Deceit, deceit, deceit. So you cutting through the BS. Definitely got the divine on your side. Mm hmm.
Let me straighten it up. This is like a lot going on in one family. As you can see, nothing stops the divine, my baby, do it. <laughs> divine feminine is out here for this couple, my baby. Divine feminine is out here. You will, justice is, is your nine, ten of pentacles. You got nine on your own, my baby. <laughs> Real spell. Yep. Now this parent is seeing justice. Bed they lay, they about to get in. This is crazy. Just when you think you heard it all, right, my baby? Revelations. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah. So basically this person, this parent would do all kind of stuff to the child to elicit a response so they can harvest that energy. And this is a, a vampire. Definitely a vampire, my baby. Mm -mm -mm. And they're going to be shepherded right on the way. You never juggle love. You don't have to, my baby. You don't have to juggle love. Either it is or it ain't. And anytime you feel less than the beautiful being you is, you already know what time it is. Dipset. Nobody deserves to get treated like this. Especially not a child. <laughs> There's a lot of pedophiles out here. Different faces... They all remain the same, my baby. A lot of pedophiles. Yes. Jealous of the love. Who would have thought a parent could hate on a child, my baby? <laughs> wow. Mm mm. Yeah, let's go right here. Sorry, baby. I was just getting the pictorials together. Okay. Let's get it. It's 11. Oh, let me give you your numbers. I'm sorry, baby. 246, triple threes, 345, 456. Triple fives, triple sixes, 55. Now you got 77 and another five, which makes that 55, 55. Um, portal. Divine Feminine is right here, my baby. Really, you got two portals because Divine Feminine is sitting on one. And you created one yourself. Strictly by being open. And tapping in and me meditating to get discernment. This is beautiful, right, my baby? Beautiful. Yes. Didn't I tell you the divine here for all of this? It's the sick. The sickle. Somebody is, was disappointed with their plan not working. They can't, couldn't believe their plans were foiled. Woo, 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 woo. Death is out here, my baby. Death is out here. We're going to see how close, close it is for somebody. Hmm. Yeah, this is definitely a fortune. A story we're telling about a brother of ours. Definitely. Fortune being told. Mm -mm. Somebody reaping what they saw. 
definitely a masculine energy story being told. Whether it's a family member or not, we'll see. Definitely work done in the shadows to destroy this union. A child is seeing it, my baby. What you thought was correct, death is out here. You are the son. You are a child of the divine. I see that our family member and their divine counterpart were promised good health and fulfillment of their highest hope in a prior lifetime. That's why you keep seeing the rainbows, my baby. No matter what, you was promised a good life this go round. That's why I said you are Aquarius North Node and Leo South Node. Yes. I see you are beautiful. I have abundant health. This marriage is healing you, family. Yeah, I see a lot of bouquets. I see you still like to give flowers. I see a lot of our family members rushing to get some flour. Flour, flowers, weed. <laughs> a lot of our family members cutting off the connection to this toxic parent. This person is not going to change. That's readily available. That's readily apparent. This parent is between. This is crazy. was born in 52 plus or minus a year so from uh, 51 to 53 1951 to 1953 this um, or it could be someone from 69 to 70 eight years old this parent so this person is not going to change but i see you got the divine on your side that's the truth yes i see you have elevated for sure my baby um because of honor your high honor and recognition of all your work. And you're going to have business success, my baby. Definitely a royal. Roses is out here, my baby. Two roses, two divine royal families again. Coming up with your own crest, family crest, huh? And the divine definitely lets you know about this ch chicanery going on, right? Anything that tries to assail you, threaten you, attack you, or whatever, the divine lets you know. Definitely told you to sever this relationship, my baby. Hmm. I see you distrusting this parent and any uh, acquaintances seeking to betray you. You're going to always, always be informed. It's another ace, ace, ace of heart. Anytime something threatens this union, you're going to always be informed. Ace of diamond, ace of pentacles, I mean.
10, 10, another quarter. Well, 10, 10, two X's, should I say, right? Yeah, I see you averted this evil spell. You were cunning, huh? Someone thought they were cunning, but not as cunning as a fox, right, my baby? The birds warned you about this fox in the hen house, huh, my baby? <laughs> the show. Yes, you know that someone loves you and longs for you. Emperor and Empress. They feel the same way about you, my baby. Same way about you. <laughs> wow. Divine Union 22. This is the future of Emperor and Empress. A brother and a sister of ours. Fortune is being read with this reading. Definitely being read. Mass divine masculine and divine feminine. Mm mm. For sure. Mm mm. Definitely a marriage. Anybody trying to mess with this marriage, it's a wrap. They're going to learn about consequences. Something about this divine feminine, though. The divine feminine always. Bring joy to the emperor. Divine masculine, divine feminine. Yeah, I see you, uh, Mr. Emperor. You run home to get this love, don't you, my baby? No. Next time, I hope in this divine union that each other, we both listen. It looks like divine masculine is going to be listening now. He wasn't listening before, but he got the memo. He's seen it with his own eyes, so now you don't have to worry about nothing. He saw the deception and the envy. For sure. Covered in your position. This is crazy. Right, my baby? The luck of the Irish, my baby. <laughs> the luck of the Irish. Good news is coming to you, my baby. Good news is coming to you. Trust and believe that. I so see you did a burning ritual too. <laughs> you sensed the deception and the envy. You did a burning ritual too. That's beautiful. Did you hear it? Uh -uh. Let's see how you've been spending your energy. For some reason I'm being prompted to you, Jesus. Nine of Pentacles. Yes. Someone was kind of codependent in this relationship. Queen of Swords. Wow, my baby. See, you broke it down to the last compound, right, my baby? Queen of Swords definitely been getting down to business, right, my baby? About the King of Pentacles and the haters. 
the sun is definitely seeing all the haters around him. Not just the parent, but it's, it's five more haters around him. Strictly because he has wealth. Wealth and love. It's a lot of Get third party energy. This is fifth party energy, my baby. <laughs> yes, I see the queen one playing. The queen cut off the energy until the king can see the haters. That's how it went. When the queen... When the empress got tired of talking and trying to tell the emperor what was going on, she just cut off her energy, detached herself from the situation to let the sun see the deception and envy itself. And my oh my, did he see it. <laughs> wow. Cray cray. People is cray cray too, my baby. Yes, they are. Hmm. Self-love. That's what the emperor had to learn. His last little obstacle was how to love themselves to get this new beginning. But remember, the divine feminine was sitting on this portal. Looked like the divine feminine had to get up. <laughs> Something happened. We're going to see. Mm -hmm. Divine Feminine had to get up and act on something. Let's, let's see what it is, my baby. What transpired? Divine Feminine is not playing. <laughs> Them days is over with, my baby. Yes. You're very strong. You... Definitely kept this union together. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> you know why? Because you're a conscious co-creator with the universe, divine sovereign being. This empress right here is making it pop. This empress right here, yes. Patiently. Patiently waiting. <laughs> Patience of Joe, my baby. Yes. Empress knows. She doesn't chase. She just attracts. Yes. Yes. Emperor is learning to love themselves, to feed themselves. Yes. Emperor got two truths about two dark plans. Emperor got truth about someone plotting on them on their path. Two truths about it, at least. Two truths about five people. What's done in the dark shall come to the light, my baby. You know, but this union is protected. You're protected, my emperor. <laughs> right, you're walking with the truth. You're walking on your path. And shit shaking, my baby. Denada. Denada, my baby. Mm-mm. Yeah, somebody been... Planning, plotting, and strategizing on a divine child, a badass band. It's not going to work. You know what I'm saying? This person only appears every three days to see if you're fucked up. I just wanted to stress that. See if you're devastated, your life is crumbling. You know what I'm saying? And I see, like I said, Divine Feminine saw the whole thing. Saw the play. And the players. Yes.
I don't know if the emperor saw it while she was. Looks like she was drinking coffee or tea. Because it's like hot and she's like blowing over it. Yes. I see you don't fuck with this karmic ass person at all, huh, Empress? The Empress don't fuck with him. Nobody, you know what I'm saying? It took the Emperor for a minute, a minute to figure it out. Empress don't fuck with nothing that's low vibrational, period. It's not going to be able to work out. This person has d done the Empress so greasy. Look at the black heart. You know what I'm saying? It also it really looks like this dad dropped seeds of discontent in their child's heart. Instead of steering them right, they were steering them wrong. They were steering them to be dogmatic toward the empress. But guess what? The dead got sacrificed. Dead got sacrificed. Because ain't nobody climbing up no mountain. They're going around the mountain. Selling in the waters of love. <laughs> that's why the plan didn't work. And that's why, you know, let's see what's in plan, what's in store for them. I just wanted to see if I see uh, any more It's the, like I said, the emperor is cutting off any things, movement, anything moving backwards, they ignore anything that doesn't make them happy, you know what I'm saying, it's not devoting the truth to them, you know what I'm saying, they fall back from, for sure. The divine realm has told the emperor to work on their messages. And they'll handle the wolves that try to come against their marriage. And, you know, continue to protect the empress. They got this whole couple. The empress is definitely a pride. Definitely a royal. Really, both of them are. Real spell. But something about this empress. Right. And anytime you feel some type of way, don't open your door. You don't have to open your door to anybody. You don't have to be bothered, my baby. Or else spell the wrong way. Yeah. This person was throwing darts at you. Right? But does it really look like it's touching you? It's not touching you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right. This black magic didn't work. For shizzle. King of Wands again. I told you, you know, the black magic. Yeah. This King of Wands lost their power, too. This King of Wands lost their spiritual gifts and abilities. Just like they turned their back to the world, to this, to their children, the Divine is turning their back to this King of Wands. You know what I'm saying? You can't do dirt and think you're going to get rewarded. That's, see, that's why you're peaceful and serene, right, my baby? You know temperance is out here, right? Teaching you patience. To sit back and and watch this deception and envy. That's what you're doing. You're watching it. But guess what? Here comes judgment right here. Discernment, the truth. You know what I'm saying? Transforming your transfiguration, my baby. <laughs> like I said, but guess what? The tower came down. See, like, let me keep you to the play. Normally, when things have a shaky foundation, the universe, you know, just knocks it down. Anything not built on love has got to go. 
But for this person, look with the universe. The universe is making sure all the shit burns down. Definitely got their eye on this person. Shit is about to pop off. Just you wait and see. Divine feminine in full effect, my baby. <laughs> right. No more haters. No more people messing with you. <laughs> yes. No more king of swords. No more five of wands. That shit is over with. It's Marriage is strong, has strong foundations. So you even get messages about that. And about others along your way. Because at the end of the day, my baby, <laughs> you're Nine of Pentacles again. Nine of Pentacles again, my baby. It's down here. I just got to find it. It's definitely down here. We just came across it. Emperor again, right? Someone's dad is guiding their steps. Yeah, you had Nine of Pentacles, my baby. Real spell. We pulled that card already. Here we go. <laughs> woo, 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 woo. Yep. But first off, didn't I told you, tell you a little birdie be talking to you? A little birdie be talking to you? <laughs> you tapping into the divine realm, right, my baby? Nine of Pentacles again. This is the divine union. Both partners is out here getting them. Look at that. Beautiful. <laughs> right. Definitely talking to pops. You know what I'm saying? Right. Any illusions, fantasies? Trying to have you stuck up in your mind. It's not going to not gonna work. Yes, I see that whoever is planning part of strategize and has been separated from you. Divine Feminine is giving you the strength to move on from a broken heart. Three of Swords twice. Yeah. You were sad to see that someone so close betrayed you, but it is what it is. Wow. Yeah. How long do people think this is going to go on? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And truthfully, they do it because... Spiritually, they're lacking. This is the type of person, this is an illusionist. They can't make it pop on their own. So they just try to steal energy. They keep shit popping so they can run off with that energy from the chaos and the havoc and shit that they try to create. You know what I'm saying? Universe, remember that all seeing eyes out here, my baby. Anybody holding divine energy that haven't worked for it, your number has been pulled. You know what I'm saying? This is how the universe is looking at these people. There's one main parent that's a hater. And these five additional haters. Anything that's going against this divine union. And this cup of love. From the divine. Is being revealed and taken care of. And just know you're protected. Yes. Look at you. My baby out here getting them. Yes. So you have the two Ace of Swords, Ace of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles again. Out here getting them. Pure, clean energy, healthy and wealthy. You know what I'm saying? That's why people hate you. Because they ain't you. Here go right here. Yes, hate you because they ain't you. And you're not trapped in your mind. Yes, I see you sit down all the time. You automatic right. You're getting these downloads. 
So basically, it's for some of our family members, like I said, they, they use marijuana to tap in and meditate and clear their mind, consciously co-create strictly off their will, and they'll forever be having portals and make it pop off, forever aware. Definitely tuned in. This is a telepathic relationship between two beings. For sure. Mm -hmm. This parent is sending a lot of messages trying to find out what's going on in this union. But I see the son is sitting back watching this. Because remember, the emperor knows the truth. See that this parent is being deceptive, deceptive and envious, and is finding balance. This is beautiful. Hmm. A treating with a long handle spoon. I see you just sipping tea on it, huh, my baby? Mm-hmm. Definitely protecting your divine counterpart. But what people don't know is this couple is bringing justice out here. It's, it's a reason why this couple is together. What the divine put together, no man can tear asunder, my baby. No man can tear asunder. You want to put it like this? No, I can go like this, yeah. It's, it's a lot of, I'm going to show you this is the first definition. This marriage between these two is the truth. It is the truth. But also, this is a child. <laughs> this is a child, right, my baby? Of divine, of divine union. Two worlds child. Definitely a child of the divine. Definitely. Definitely is fair and just. Work for the legal system. Parents were very important in the spiritual realm. And the, no, the dad is important. Well, they're both important people. But the dad is helping you spiritually. Helping you see, giving you revelation. And the mom is giving you strength, helping you bear fruit and live a, a good life. Like I said, you're going to have your roses down here. Somebody's mom loved to wear neck, necklaces and neck jewelry. Loved to walk around in robes and loose-fitting clothing. Still keep getting, like, priesthood. Like, this is a um, young prince or a princess. Definitely a child of the divine. That's the truth. Law and order. And I see you bringing both. <laughs> that justice out here. You damn son. Son and a daughter of the divine. Somebody mad that their black magic isn't working. They've tried everything. They even use graveyard dirt. They even put a spell and buried the remnants in their yard. The remnants of the black magic spell, they buried in the yard or on their way to their home. This almost looks like a freezer spell. This is a freezer spell spirit. Yeah, that's what I thought. This is a freezer spell. And they threw it in the river. They threw it in the river. Definitely. 
See, you've been concentrating on your relationship. Speaking the truth, but behind your back, that's a whole different thing. Hmm. A lot of indiscretion going on in the world. I don't know who this parent hates more, the child or the spouse. The, the child or the divine counterpart. It's really looking like the child, right, my baby? Because this is nine swords. You already had ten of swords and ten of wands. But here go nine swords, and they looking. And they know that the whole part about it is this parent knows what they're doing. They're doing this shit on purpose. That's what I can't get over. They're sitting here looking like, damn, all these wands and arrows and shit I done threw, and this shit still ain't working. I can't fuck up their life. I can't fuck up my own child's life. Look how intently he can't believe it. He about to come over too. It's been three days. You know what I'm saying? Gotta see if the spell is working. But they know the spell isn't working. You're too calm and serene, remember? <laughs> Says keep on doing you. You know what I'm saying? I see uh, several of our family members went out to pick up liver, liver and kidneys, kidneys and rice they're making. Some of our family members are getting up early in the morning, going to the fruit market, the packing house, you know what I'm saying? Going to get beautified. A lot of family members are taking family pictures, family portraits for this, you know, signified family. The Empress is definitely in High Priestess mode. Definitely showing the Emperor all the instances where his energy has been drained and has been to the detriment of this relationship. Really been telling them the whole time. Yes. It's a wrap, my baby. I don't know what to say. This is beautiful. King of Pentacles again. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's what... Yeah. King of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. Here we go again. <laughs> wow. Emperor and Emperor sitting at home chilling. Enjoying their life back again. Beautiful. I told you. You know what I'm saying? The most high don't play. Your highest self. The most high. It's babysitting this union, baby. Ain't shit shaking. <laughs> yeah. Well, really, it's supposed to be over here. Because this, this is like the feminine's father. I keep feeling like this is the feminine's father. Making sure... Their child is fine. This relationship is fine. And in due time, those that worked against this relationship will soon get theirs. Don't believe me? Just watch, my baby. Self-love is the best love in this realm. And on your way, you know what I'm saying, to your beautiful life. A lot of people are purchasing cars. A lot of people are waiting on their cars to get fixed. A lot of people are getting home improvements and they're kind of getting tired of people all in their house. They're ready to just stop all that shit. This is terrible. A lot of family members are being shielded from the BS. Definitely being protected at this time. The divine realm ain't playing with this union, my baby. Let me just make sure I got all of your messages. So, I got your dreams are blossoming. And continue to have courage because miracles, the miracles that you were hoping for are about to manifest. Those were your rainbows, my baby. And the theme for you was going to be the truth sets you free. Yeah, a dead 
put a hex on a child. It's something about an emblem. I think this is an emblem. Something about an emblem. The child reminds them of the life they had when they was younger. But they didn't cherish it. So they don't want the child to cherish it. They miss their boat when they're trying to prevent their child from hopping on theirs. Smooth like that. <laughs> Brian Maskell is not playing. Brian Maskell is not playing. Anybody can get it. Anybody can get it, my baby. And they usually do. Let me move my fat fingers. Anybody can get it. Most times not playing with his children. Off with their heads. That's what I heard. A lot of broke wings and broke wounds, too. That usually goes along with losing your spiritual pro um, powers. You know, some of your chi is diminished so you get your mind right. So it's a lot of broke wings and broke wounds that's prevalent out here. You know what I'm saying? A lot of sexual dysfunction. And it's no mystery. When you do evil shit, that's what happens, right? So definitely a dad hex, hex their child's fun and joy. Tried to make them black hearted like themselves. Strictly because they feel like they have it too easy. Strictly because they're coveting things that they haven't worked for. And quite frankly, strictly because they're a piece of shit. Smooth like that. But at the end of the day, <laughs> like I said, quite frankly... You're a badass being, my baby. Badass being. Title card. Second card out here. After you made your appearance, I knew who you were. You know what I'm saying? This was the first card, the Emperor. I knew who you were before you made an appearance. My baby. Right. Continue to romance and strengthen the intimacy in this relationship. The divine has you, my baby. And always will. And I think that's it, my pet milks. I think that's it. Yeah, that was another message. Was one somebody's gonna get what's due them, and it irritates somebody that this couple is eating. They're out here living their best life. Portals after portals, right? And. It's killing them inside that this union is successful. Definitely that the child is successful. They're sick with it productions. Sick with it productions. See, they're trying to see if the plan is... Let me switch your hand. Trying to see if the plan working, right? But they sick because it ain't. The divine stepped in. The vine gonna get them some to do to keep them busy from starting shit. But enough about this person. Your life is beautiful, you know. This was a lesson well earned and a lesson well learnt. And quote the raven nevermore, right, my baby? <laughs> That's what the little birdie told you. Quote the raven nevermore. No more broken hearts for you. Someone's mom is here. Someone's mom have been telling them the whole time to watch these mofos. And that's exactly how I heard it. If your mom didn't mess with them, don't you mess with them. That's the message. So on that note, my pet milks, I love you. Keep on being strong. Keep on being out here enjoying yourself in the world. Look at everybody that loves you. Right? I see you're going to be out here shopping. 
Spinning up coins, my baby. Spinning up coins. Yes. Yeah, you see, you about to have from nineteen to thirty nine hundred dollars. Right. Let me just make sure. Yeah, nineteen to thirty one hundred dollars at least, right, my baby? In the next two to four days. Nineteen to thirty nine hundred in the next two to four days, my baby. It's a lot of pinnacles out here, to say the least. You're beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And keep on keeping on. You don't have to worry about your image, reputation, none of that. Your name is still good out here. There's no problems with the divine on your side, my baby. See you in a few days.